Estamos en el salón de Nueva York, nada más y nada menos que con John Guastaferro. John, how are you doing? I'm doing well, thank you. John es el ejecutivo, el director ejecutivo de la fundación Hyundai on Wheels, Hope on Wheels, sorry. I, I, I forgot the, the most important word there, hope. Hope, it's hope. all about hope. It's all about hope. And John is uh, actually the guy who's directing the foundation. What, what is uh, Hyundai Hope on Wheels about? Yeah. Hyundai Hope on Wheels is a non-profit foundation for the non-profit side of Hyundai and uh, it's all about ways we can give back. It's our long, uh, most cherished cause and we've been doing this for 25 years. It started off in 1998 with a couple Hyundai dealers donating to a local hospital and today we're funding hospitals across the nation to help um, pediatric cancer research and support. Today we hear big news about Hyundai but the biggest one was a great donation. Absolutely. This is our 25th anniversary, and in honor of that, all the dealers and Hyundai Motor America came together and, and uh, we're committing $25 million in research and support grants to help hospitals and researchers across the nation. It's the largest single year donation we've ever made. And this brings a lifetime total to $225 million. I know it sounds a lot of money, but is that money enough, uh, John, or Now, we have a, a big job in front of that. I, I don't know if it's never enough because our goal is to one day end childhood cancer. Wow. And this money um, will allow us in our lifetime to fund 1,300 uh, um, research studies um, to 175 institutions across the nation. Now, back in the 1970s, the survival rate for kids with cancer was about 57%. Now it's upwards of 85%. We're making progress, but we won't stop till we get to 100%. Wow, congratulations. Yeah. I suppose those numbers give you a, a, a lot of hope. Yes. And, uh, but I'm, I'm also pretty sure that there are not so great moments in, in, in your daily job. You know, certainly, when, when 85% is a number to celebrate, but, but sadly, there are kids that don't survive. Um, and uh, you know, I, I've seen it firsthand. We got notes from hospitals where we had a, a photo of a child on our social media, and then we found out that, um, sadly, they, they, didn't, they didn't make it. Um, but we also celebrate those moments for the kids who do. Um, there's many kids um, decades ago who had leukemia where it would, be, uh, it would be the end for them, and now they are surviving and thriving. And we have, we have two, two of these great examples, our National Youth Ambassadors, Rainy and Oliver, 10 and 11 years old, and they give us hope every day. Absolutely. <laughs> They're going to travel with us across the nation to share their stories with other kids fighting cancer to know that they can get through this as well. And we're going to help them every step of the way. Okay, uh, what's the most important part of your job when you have to decide where to, to put your money, I suppose? Yeah, well, uh, how sure. it works? Yeah, you know, when we focus on research studies, it's important that we understand the medical side of things. So we have, okay. we have an esteemed medical advisory committee who reviews all of our grants and they help us award where these grants go. Um, they, know, they know how to do this more than we do because it's, it's, uh, it's very technical. We, uh, I suppose, uh, yes. you know, we've seen in the past decades that there's um, a lot of medical advances as well. So a lot of the treatments for kids these days are less invasive than they used to be, but we have the doctors helping us decide where those grants go. But in addition to research grants, we also provide program grants. So there's hospitals across the nation that receive impact awards and regional community grants so we can help provide um, additional support beyond research. I know today is all about this big donation, mm -hmm. but I, I want to know a little bit more about uh, Mr. Guastaferro. And, <laughs> yeah, and, okay. and, and I'm, I'm pretty curious about your magician side. <laughs> It's a pretty elusive side, yeah. <laughs> I, I'm deeply dedicated to philanthropy. It's a big part of my life for the past 20 plus years. Um, when I'm not doing that, I am a magician. I performed across the world. What does that have to do with today? It's all about bringing wonder to people's lives. And honestly, when I'm performing magic, I make things look impossible. But when I'm working at Hyundai Hope and Wheels, we are truly making the impossible possible for families. Uh, so, yeah. No sé qué opinan ustedes, pero me parece que la tarea de John eh, Guastaferro y de todo el equipo de Hyundai Hope and Wheels is kind of magic. <laughs> It, is. Guys. It is, absolutely. Okay, what's what's next? I mean, we, we got a, a big announcement, 25 years yeah. on the go and, uh, yeah. and making more research and uh, bringing more hope to the yeah. to the kids. Sure. What's, what's next? For Our you? year of hope really starts today. We're at the New York International Auto Show. We made this big announcement of $25 million. Uh, the next few months, we're going to be awarding these grants to researchers and hospitals across the nation. Rainy and Oliver will, will be traveling with us, sharing their stories. 
We'll be doing our handprint ceremonies. Yep. Where kids place their handprints on cars, on the doctor's lab coats. It's Are those real, real uh, hats, these, right? These were modeled from real kids who we we're helping give hope to. So it, every one of these handprints is a symbol of our progress and our history and and the collaboration that it takes to truly solve this problem. So we're gonna, um, over the past several, next several months, we'll be doing that. And in September, it's National Childhood yep. Cancer Very Awareness important. Month. September. So we'll be meeting in Washington, D.C. We'll be doing a thought leadership summit on the topic of survivorship when it comes to childhood cancer and holding a big gala to get all of our partners and to celebrate our progress and also to look to the next 25 years. Let's tell our people, our followers, how they could get involved or help somehow. Sure. Amigos, yeah. le estoy preguntando a John, ¿qué pueden hacer ustedes eh, por ayudar en esta magnífica causa y a la fundación, en este caso, que dirige John? In addition to providing funding, we also want to provide awareness. So anytime you have the chance to spread the word and show the importance of helping kids who have cancer, help us do that. You can follow us on social media. You can go to HyundaiHopeOnWheels.org. Um, you can certainly donate if you'd like. Help us spread the word because this is a cause that's so important. And we want you to be part of our movement to help end childhood cancer. Hyundai has the, the Progress for Humanity motto. Sure. How that apply to the foundation in this case? Yeah. I love this progress for humanity. It's the global vision, Hyundai. Okay. And it's how we can give back to humanity. Um, Hyundai Hope on Wheels is a big part of that. We're a nonprofit foundation. We have a board of directors deeply carrying across progress for humanity. But we are, we're also very heavily um, involved in corporate social responsibility and many other ways that we give back from the Hyundai brand. So all of that together is under this wonderful umbrella of progress for humanity. Let me ask you last one more question. Okay. What will be your ultimate trick to solve this problem? You know, this this time next year, I would love I would love to go to anybody on the street and say they've heard of Hyundai Open Wheels, but even more importantly, that we are we have found a cure, or at least moving closer to cure. We want to see progress. You know, when we're doing research studies, we want to help make new discoveries that move us closer to a cure. The ultimate trick is that 85% is to 100%. We'll get there. Thank you very much. Right. Thank you so much. For your work, your Absolutely. hard work. Thank you for the interview. And thank all of you. Amigos, ya saben, busquen el website Hyundai Hop on Wheels y ahí van a saber mucho más de lo que hace John y todo su equipo, que les aseguro son gente que tiene muy claro lo que deben hacer y lo que están haciendo por todos los chicos alrededor nuestro acá en Estados Unidos. Adiós. Gracias. Gracias. Thank you. <laughs> thank you very much. Thank you very much. Thank you very much.